system starting in northern, up and way up near Haida, um, all the way down to Olympia, all the way out to Nia Bay, uh, Victoria, is a very highly productive system. <coughs> and that's why it's so good for all kinds of things, like orcas, you know, and, but, and seals, and everything, but um, also birds. And that's why all these birds are down here. In the fall, winter, and spring, we have about 44 species that are very common that come to this region. I don't listen to people, I listen to the birds. And basically what's going on here is, is some level of anxiety. They're, they're anxious, and the reason they'd be anxious is because of a predator. That, but it's not a predator that's right here. It's a predator that's half a mile or a mile away. And they're just kind of like, keep your eye on it, all right? Keep your eye on it. That's pretty much what's going on there. Other, it's also possible um, that they're just spouting off anxiety because they just feel anxious in general. So that's possible too. We know all about that. Yeah. Yeah, we know all about that, yes. <laughs> got a new classmate. Oh, I'm sorry. These birds are killing me. Um, <laughs> we got to get through this fast. <laughs> There's five. Two, all, those two great blue herons. Isn't that a flicker? I yeah, hear it. There's five double-crested cormorants flying across there. Their residence, by the way, there's a nice woodpecker. It's not a marine bird, but it's called a flicker. We have no chance of making it in South America. That black thing is gone. It's going to definitely be eagle food. <laughs> there's actually the common loon, the red throated loon, the Pacific loon, the Arctic loon, and the um, and yellow filled loon. So there's actually five loon species. Sounds like you've got to have that set. Looney friends. <laughs> there you go. See, you got it. <laughs>